So this is our new staff room. It was actually um, the community school room in our old building. Uh, this is actually where the front entrance was. We had the bulletproof glass and we have the roll down so that it, we can quickly secure this space because that's what happened last time is we were unable to notify the rest of the school and get to a safe space. When we were planning the renovations, we had a lot of students, um, a lot of meetings with students and we asked them what they would like to see in the building. And one of the things they said is they wanted a retail space. One of the offices will be for visiting medical personnel. This is kind of storage, labeled storage right now, but we're, we're repurposing it into an exam room. And uh, SASC Health Authority is going to help us with that so that we actually have the doctors come here to see the students. We saved an extra. It was a traumatic experience that day. And it will, con the, the effects of feeling the trauma has impacted not only the student body, the teachers. You can feel that energy and that renewal, right? Because uh, when you come into the entrance, the new entrance, it, and you see that we're Dennis Strong, and you know the amount of support that the community had from others coming in today to show their support, you just can't replace that. Uh, the reopening cer certainly was stalled due to the fact that we did not have all the funds we needed to begin the project. We had to lobby, a number of folks lobby to get those funds and finally as a result of lobbying efforts from everyone, uh, from government officials, from the school division, from the school board, um, from the mayor, uh, everyone sort of lobbying for those additional funds. Uh, it finally came through and then that allowed us then to carry, and carry on and move forward with uh, the rebuild. Well, we'll always be working with the Lalash community. Uh, the renovations definitely is one step. There was over four million invested in the renovations of the school and needed to be done. Uh, I'm a mother first and I can't imagine uh, myself having my daughters when they were students to come to a school where there was a tragedy and, and things were not changed.